matron take them away. Okay, guys, um, I'm going to go to market and we're going to look at Cape. So let's flip the chart on. There we go. Now, I've already done the buy sheet on this. Now, the buy sheet is something that I put in the Scruffy Squad, which is here. So it's telling me at two o'clock, and it's just after two, that we buy in it. It's an A grade, in other words, there's a lot of boxes ticked. It's telling me to be fair with it, 10 plus, right? So get 10 pips out of it. And when it says it's fair, it means pretty much everything is looking for the upside, okay? Um, the next step up is good. If it says it's good, that means everything is ticking, ticking the box. Now, where that's placed, if you haven't seen this, is in here. Now, every morning, I put in the strength sheet, which is which is here. Uh, this went in at 20 by 7. And what it starts doing is it starts picking out which products are pretty good. And as we can see here, the US and the pound are pretty much close together. And when you see something like that, there's not a lot of movement. Hence a fair trade. All right, so you're looking for about 10 pips. It hasn't pulled out um, cable, but it is a market that I look at every day. So I look at it in the London, and well, that's kind of still running. And I'm going to have a, a cheeky look at the USJPY um, just while we're working. So if you see that come in, it's just me having a little look at it. From there onwards, I put it into here, uh, where they will see the sheet. They know what I'm doing, they know what I'm looking for. So let's have a little look and see if we can set this up while we're on. Now, let's take that order out, because it hasn't come down as far as I would like, um, but it does have a good upward move. That actually looks like we want to be putting it in now. Now, so what we're going to do is we're going to drop it in there and we're going to set this for about 10 pip. Right, well, it's it's in now, okay? So we're, we're, we're in like Flynn. So up to 10 pips, so up to that yellow line. Why the yellow line? It's a barrier. And that's what I do. I trade into barriers. The blue ones are entry exits. I can trade into this as well, but I'm looking for 10 pips. So I missed that one out and I'm looking for this one. Simple stuff, guys. Simple stuff. Now, what else have we got here? Um, okay. So that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. And then we also are having a look at the DAX. Now the DAX have already been in this morning, so I'll kind of leave that alone and we'll concentrate on this. Now if I pull this out to the hourly, you'll see it's had a colossal run up. It's pushed down, but look where it pushed down to. It pushed down to the cluster points here and is now rejecting that cluster and is moving back up. So even if it's on a retracement to the upper side, in and around this yellow mark is the place. Because look, it balances out with this. Simple stuff. So let me run the trade and I'll come back to you when it's done. Okay guys, that's it done. Nice simple trade, straight up into target. Happy as Larry. So what else are we doing? Well, on the 
a little look at cheeky look at the Aussie as well. So let's just drop these off and we'll quickly show you that. Exact same principle. Let the candle come to you, in it comes, let it run up. Drop it to five minutes and we'll see if this little bad boy will pay us as well. Okay guys, that's the two trades done. Nothing running, tickets are out, and that's added a nice little chunk to what we were doing sort of yesterday stroke this morning. Um, 645 over the last couple of days. Live with that, you know, it's not bad at all. Considering one of us, not mentioning any names, but it's her. Because you spent a sudden fortune today. No, I did. That was your fault. How'd you figure that out? You said, shall we make the garden nice? I said, shall we make the garden nice? Mm -hmm. Which translated into what? And then you had your little drawing out with your decking and stuff. Right, and? Well, then you went and bought it. <sighs> yeah, but what else did we buy? So when two that times... Was your, that was your fault as well. You said you were tired and you needed a break. No, you said I was tired and I needed a break. Which was code for get me a holiday. Otherwise, you're staying at home and I'm going fat boy. No, right? I wouldn't do that. Yeah, you would. No, I wouldn't. Yeah, you would. I wouldn't. You would. I wouldn't. Would you not? No. Would you not leave us behind? No. Why? Well, I do like you sometimes. You like me sometimes? Oh, Isn't that nice? Well... Today was a very quick one. Um, it's really just to show consistency constantly on the charts. Um, and you'll see it, it's the same chart over and over again. And that's it. If, if you're looking for the secret pill in trading, it is just get in, get out, walk away. That's it, you know. To try and over trade all the time, eventually, the, the market gods will catch up with you and they will take your money off you. They genuinely will. So just look for half decent setups, get in, manage it, have a realistic expectation of target, take the money when it's offered and then just go about your day. That's, that's the best way I can describe trading. It's certainly trading for me. Um, I, I trade for freedom. I don't trade for the love of the screen or anything like that. Um, it, it's just my job. It's a means to an end. I'm, I'm not addicted to the screen or anything like that. I don't have to be in the markets all the time. It's just my job. You know, If you feel compelled to be in the markets constantly and you have to be there, you've got to be looking at the screens. You'll probably find you're spinning wheels all the time because you'll have a tendency to overtrade, you'll take on too much risk at any one time, and eventually it just catches up with you. So that's it. So if you're stuck, very easy found, drop down in the comments, you get all my contact details. And as always, trade well, keep your risk managed, but above all, do what you love, and the money will follow. See you all in the next one.